Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Ultra, Samsung S23 Ultra and Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 Pro. And in this video, I am going to talk about how you can use these three devices together for your productivity. So first of all, you can use your S23 Ultra as a toolbar for your Tab S8 Ultra. So for example, I want to take notes. I open the Samsung notes and here you can see this icon. Once I select it, it will open the toolbar here on my S23 Ultra and now I can start taking my notes on this tab S8 Ultra as a full screen. Now if I want to change uh, the tools, so here for example I select this highlighter tool so I can use this highlighter tool and then for example if I want to use the shape tool, I can just select the shape tool from here and I can create different neat shapes. Okay, the next thing is for example I want to use this handwriting to text tool so here I can use this handwriting to text tool whatever I write it will convert it into my handwriting in a text form okay so here you can use all the tools if you want to undo you can undo from here so you will have your full screen available on your tab s8 ultra the next thing is once you finish uh, your work you can just disable this toolbar option okay and then you can go back okay so your notes will be saved automatically in both of these devices so for example if i want to access it i can access it from my s23 ultra okay so i will open the samsung notes so here you can see i have this note over here and here as well the next thing is you can access your notes in your galaxy watch 5 pro as well what you have to do you have to save your notes as an image okay so here you can see these three dots just select it once you select it here you can see this option of save as file just select it once you select it here you see this option of image file so you have to save your notes as an image file so once you select this image file you can give it any location okay so for example i give it a location of pictures okay and then i press done okay and then i save it okay so my notes are saved as a image now i can access these notes into my galaxy watch 5 pro okay so what i have to do is i will go to my apps section in my galaxy watch okay so i will just scroll it like this okay and it will open my apps and here i have to scroll down and you will see uh, the app is gallery okay so this is the gallery app just select it once you select it here you can see the same uh, notes are available in my watch as well so same notes are available so i can access my notes as an image file in my galaxy watch 5 pro the next tip is about using samsung flow to access my s23 ultra inside my tab s8 ultra so what i will do i will open the samsung flow in my tablet i will also open the samsung flow in my phone they both get connected now i open the smart view option so here i select the smart view and here i can select start now now whatever activity i perform i can see in my tablet so here you can see whatever i am doing on my phone i can see in my tablet now the next thing what i will do is i will open it in a split screen view like this okay and then what i will do is i will open any app in uh, my tablet so for example i open the samsung notes i can start taking my notes now whatever notification appear on my phone i can access it for example i am having a lecture and i am having a call okay so here you can see i am having a call i can access it through my tablet whatever activity is going on i can access for example i don't want to receive this call i can directly use my tablet to uh, decline this call so here you can see i will just decline it okay so i can access everything from my tablet as well the next tip is about multitasking so here you can see I have my phone on this side now what I will do I will open another app for example I open internet browser I will just scroll it I open in a split screen view like this so here you can see I can take my notes okay whatever I want to do I can do over here now for example I want to open the split screen in the phone I can also do it so what I will do is for example I want to open uh, the internet browser so I will just open this edge panel in my phone and here you can see it also open and now for example i open the internet browser like this in a split screen so here you can see my phone 
is showing the split screen option okay and here i will open the samsung notes so here i will have different notes so here you can see i have four different screens are open i can also make it little bigger like this okay so i can do all my activities okay so here you can see i'm using my tablet i can use the other app so here if i want to take notes i can take my notes so here you can see whatever i'm writing it is also showing over here okay and now for example i want to access uh, this internet browser i have uh, this website i can also access it for example if i want to highlight something i can highlight it is also showing over here so here you can see this is how it all works the next thing is for example i want to put this phone in a, another room i will turn on the camera to see the activities what is going on so what i will do is i will just go back i will open my phone camera from my tablet okay so here i just open the phone camera so the camera will open so now let's say my phone is in another room so i can see whatever activity is going on through my tablet okay so for example i will take a picture okay so let's say i will take a picture like this okay on my phone okay so the picture available on my tablet as well now what i will do i will just close it and then i will access my picture through my gallery okay so i will open the gallery so here is my picture okay now i want to edit it okay because uh, i think the phone screen is small i want to edit it on my tablet i can also edit it through my tablet i just select this edit option in my tablet and then for example i select this emoji icon and then for example if i want to write something so here you can see i can write through here and it is also showing on my phone for example if i want to erase something i can also erase it if i want to write some text okay so i can write any text over here okay so i can do all my editing once i finish i can just press done okay and then i save okay so this picture will save in my gallery now this picture i can also access it through my galaxy watch 5 pro so now i will open the app section in my watch okay so i will just scroll it like this and then i will open the gallery okay so i will open the gallery again so here is the gallery icon i will just select it so here you can see i have this image available that image that i just added through my tab s8 ultra okay and it is also showing on my phone the next tip is about using your galaxy watch 5 pro for your health activities and you can track your health activities through your tab s8 ultra and through your s23 ultra so for example i start uh, doing this running okay so here you can see this running i just select it okay and i start my workout okay so whatever workout i will do whatever health activity i will do i can access it through samsung health app in my tab s8 ultra and s23 ultra okay so for example i just finish this activity i will just finish it okay and now what i will do is i can just open this samsung health app okay i just select the samsung health so here you can see i can access through here and i can also access in my tablet as well the next tip is using your s23 ultra to charge your galaxy watch 5 pro so what you can do is you can use the wireless power sharing option so i will just turn on this wireless power sharing now what i will do i will just put my phone like this okay and then i put my watch behind my phone i can just put over it like this okay and now you can see it start charging but the problem is i cannot access my phone because the phone is in this position so what i will do i will just put it like this i will put my watch to start charging and i can access my phone through my tablet using the samsung flow option okay so i already opened the samsung flow okay so here is my phone okay so here you can see now i can access my phone okay so here you can see whatever i want to do i can access it uh, through my tablet okay so here you can see so for example if i want to open uh, some app okay so for example i open the samsung notes i can open my samsung notes okay and here i can open any other app on my tablet i can also access it the next tip is about s pen so guys the s23 ultra comes with an s pen okay and the tab s8 ultra also comes with an s pen the good thing is you can use both of these s pens in both of these devices so for example i have uh, this s pen that comes with s23 ultra i can 
use in my tab s8 ultra as well so here you can see i can open my notes i can write with it okay so i can take my notes okay so this s pen comes with s23 ultra okay and same thing if i want to use over in my s23 ultra i can use it over here as well so now let's talk about this s pen that comes with the tab s8 ultra so you can use in s23 ultra to take notes as well so here you can see i can take my notes i can use the eraser i can also use it for highlighter as well and i can also use it in my tab s8 ultra as well the next tip is using your galaxy watch 5 pro as a remote control to access your s23 ultra so for example i want to turn on the camera i just use uh, this uh, button in my galaxy watch 5 pro i press it two times and it will turn on the camera on my s23 ultra now i can control uh, my phone through this watch so for example i want to take a picture okay i will just press from here and it will start taking the picture okay so here you can see it took the picture for me now i can also access it so here is my picture now let's say i want to record a video so what i will do i just select this record video option so here is the video mode okay now for example i want to record this video i just select from here and it will start recording and once i finish i can just stop it okay so both of uh, these picture and the video will automatically save in your gallery in your phone and then if you want to access it through your tablet you can also access it the next tip is about creating notes in your galaxy watch 5 pro using google keep app okay so i will just open this google keep okay so here is the google keep okay and now for example i want to create a note i just select this plus icon and here you see this option of create note or create list i will just select this create note option okay and here uh, you can create a note you can write anything for example i will write here lecture okay so i will just write here lecture so here you can see and then i select this uh, tick icon and it start creating a note for me and then for example i want to add a reminder this evening okay so here the reminder has been added the note has been done now i just uh, finish my work from here now for example i want to access it through my phone i can just open this keep notes app the same google keep app so here you can see i have this um, uh, note available over here so here you can see lecture today at 6 p.m the same note that i just created and the same uh, google keep app i can also access in my tab s8 ultra i open this and here you can see this note has been added to my tablet as well so guys this is for today's video so please like this video and please subscribe to my channel thank you very much